<laughs> now, as the countdown to the Olympics continues, some of the many associated cultural events tied to the Games are gathering pace. The World Shakespeare Festival 2012 is one of them. It'll be launched later this month. The festival will celebrate the Bard's work in more ways than one, as Kevin Reed reports. The Winston Green area of Birmingham may seem a million miles from Shakespeare's Stratford, but this is where the Royal Shakespeare Company is recruiting its latest talent. They want an all-black cast for a version of Julius Caesar to be set in Africa. The inspiration has come from Nelson Mandela's known appreciation of the play and also comparisons between Caesar's rule and that of African rulers right up to the present day. Some of the news coverage in recent months has definitely focused a lot of attention to some of the things that have been happening in Africa with the uprisings and everything like that. And, you know, Julius Caesar um, feels very fitting to set within that context. Recruiting from one ethnic group may be contentious, but the RSC says it needs to, to make the play authentic and realistic, adding that it's acting within the law. One volunteer who hopes to be selected is George Gordon. He could soon find himself on stage alongside leading black actors, including Ray Fearon, Patterson Joseph and Cyril Inrai. Shakespeare is associated with using the English language in a, in a very effective way. Uh, that's my perceptive anyway, <laughs> my perception. And so it has relevance wherever you are in Great Britain. And Winston Green is no exception. And Birmingham, I might is no exception either. This African incarnation of Julius Caesar forms part of the world's Shakespeare celebrations taking place this year, and it's all about spreading the Bard's word as far and wide as possible. And for example, there are performers coming to the UK from as far afield as Brazil and Baghdad. Obviously, this year, 2012, is all about the Olympics. You'd think that was all about sport, but it's also about culture, arts, music, theatre, of course. Um, so it's really saying that, that Shakespeare is, belongs to the world, just like the Olympics do. Um, they don't just belong to Britain. The African version of Julius Caesar is due on stage in Stratford at the end of May. And if you want to take part, there are more details on the RSC's website. Kevin Reed, BBC Midlands Today, Birmingham. And the star of Homeland, David Harewood, returns to Birmingham to work with a group of teenagers from his old school to perform a section of scenes from Macbeth as part of the World Shakespeare Festival. You can see how they get on in a special programme here on BBC One. That's 10 past 11 on Sunday, the 22nd of April. Well, it wasn't just the snow.